Welcome back, you lovely boys, to this another FIFA 17 Ice Cream Mode. And guys, 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 it's your number one fat Asian. We coming to you. If you remember, in the last episode, we were absolutely able to push aside Real Madrid 2 0 and then 2 1. And now, in this episode, we face the big one. The one that has eluded us from the last season, and that is can we capture the Orange Cup? We got a big match up against Auto Den Hog only three days after our big match up against Real Madrid. Then we get into May. We got Man City then PSV, and then Man City again. I'm gonna try, haven't been able to do this in a while, but I'm gonna try to get three games into this freaking episode. And that doesn't get your nipple hot, I don't know what will. And while that nip is hot, smush it, smush it on the live button. Without further ado, let's go ahead, let's get into a press conference. Do you remember this? We have a rivalry up against Otto Den Haag. I'm gonna go ahead and praise them, the classic Hikari Mugen move. And since it was three days away, we have to heavily rotate our side to go up in the Orange Cup. We have Mbappe Lawton, the absolute <laughs> best young player in the world right now. I don't think there's any, you know, contest on who's winning that race. Up front, we're getting Moses Simon. He's been good when we've used him. Irvin Lozano, Chucky is gonna be out on the right. Nori, Sari. Uh, Riddlewald and Dabo are going to be in the Diamond. Royn Van Dyke, who's been fantastic since signing him, and Dalbert. I mean, both of them have been great defensive signings so far, and Onana in between six. On the bench, we have Poulsen, Tete, Cherny, Taliso, Pavon, Seprian, and of course, Sinkraven. Let's get into it. Look at us! We getting into a game in under a minute of... Oh, I'm a change be modest. I'm a changed fat Asian. I become the hashtag skin. I believe this is the semi-final, if not, then it's the quarter-final, but I think realistically only about one or two more episodes left in this. Should I do a super episode? You know, just kind of my favorite moments looking back on uh, my total time here at IX. What's crazy is when I started this career mode, I didn't even do face cam. I didn't even do live com. It was a post com series for season one. Then season two, I switched over to the face cam, and then my... I really feel like the channel kind of took off. Like, it, it took, like, uh, I evolved from, from first level Pokemon to second level Pokemon, definitely. Goes in and sets up in a 4 3 3. Exactly what we like to see, not gonna lie. They got Lawless out on the left side, but hopefully we can see them. And what? Is this the final? What? I did. <laughs> I swear to God, I looked at the thing. Okay, who's our captain of the day? Dabo, if you're going to be the one to lift it up, I'm okay with that. Dabo, you've been here for quite a while, and you've been a good soldier. But anyway, uh, second teamers, go capture. <laughs> go capture the domestic cup now. Well, that's great movement, and Onana, kind of an instinctual save there. Oh! Oh. oh, there we go. There we go. Thread the needle. Oh, Lozano. Chuck it. Oh, great left-footed pinger. Let's bring... No, yeah, let's bring it in. Why not? Everyone. Everyone. Oh, I just banged my thing. But here we go. Hey, guys. You wanted more. Yeah, get more. Good work. Kind of misplayed it a little bit, but uh, the passing lane opened up for Nori to go ahead and slot it in right behind the defense, and we catch him sleeping, and that is a brilliant Leung tuck away. Up 1-0 early on Otto Den Hog. Can we pressure? It's been the story. I'm literally like a broken record. Scoring's easy for us. Keep him out of our own net. That is the true battle. Oh! Forcing him not to parry that away. Oh, Lozano! Oh, God! Lumos. Lumos. P in my back! Yes! And the brilliant Frenchman, who's been quiet this season, not gonna lie, goes ahead and puts us up 2 dill and this might be insurmountable on the edge of halftime. I think we're gonna do the smart thing. We play in four chip right here. We'll move four to the back. They've done well to make it this far. Cinderella story, no more. Not on my watch, homie. I'm a destroyer of dreams. Come on, ladies, let us get in formation. We have both our city ends and stay back while attacking. Let's go ahead and see this game out. Oh, Simon ping it. Oh, gosh. Dabo. Oh. Back to the middle. Oh. 
Great counterattacking play given right to Lozano, and we get a gift. 3 0. It's like Auto Den Hog is like, hey man, we know you guys didn't win it last year, so here you go. Just go ahead, have this little piece of silverware. You, you guys need it more than us. So, very charitable from Auto Den Hog. Thank you. I will graciously accept this fine cup that you have given me, and uh, I think I'll put some subs in right now and just see the game out. Tap it in, Paulson, and <laughs> makes it four. What difficulty are we playing on right now? Everyone gather in. Why not? Let's pour it on. Waste a bit of time. Everyone ready? 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 <laughs> what well, hog. Deal with it. Oh my god. Moses has hit fucking woodwork like six times in this game. I swear to god. Hit it, lads. Hit it, lads. Enjoy yourselves. Enjoy yourselves. Enjoy yourselves, lads. Enjoy yourselves as I go ahead and enjoy myself. The bit of kimchi. Mm. All right, Brian. Lift it up. Ah. Well done. Domestic cup captured and in the pockets. We advance, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. Look at Brian. You deserve it, buddy. All right, let's continue our momentum by trading up the lane. Trade it up, trade it up. Let it fall out. But anyways, this is a huge squad monthly report right here because we only have like three more months and we have to get all of our guys out of here because if I switch teams, they get deleted. They go into the ether. So, as you can see, we have, we're gonna leave the two comes to Academy in very good shape. Danny Van Leeuwen? Is 89 to 94 potential. He's already at 67 at the age of 17. Yes, let's go ahead and offer him a contract. Next up, we have the center mid from Sweden, Magnus Avertsen, which is an amazing name. 83 to 93 potential. We're going to go ahead and offer him a contract as well. And then the big one that I'm super happy about because he's he was, he was only 15 when we signed him up. And we are able to go ahead and bring in Mateo Romero. Look at that shit. 90 to 94 potential. It's the highest I've ever seen. The little Italian, we're gonna go ahead and try to sign him up. And then wherever I go in the next part of my save, I think I might have to go and snipe some players off of Ajax. Oh! <laughs> There's what Sanchez says. I'd like to discuss my wages. I feel like I should be earning more based on my contribution. Whoa! Young Sanchez. Um, hmm. How do I put this? Well, I'm gonna have you go ahead and vote the odd thingies. Do a scheme. Do a scheme a little bit more with Davidson Sanchez. He wouldn't be he wouldn't be too bad of a pickup, not gonna lie. Alright, we finally do have a bit of a cushion. It's not that big, but three points over Feyenoord right here. And oh uh, well, let's see what's our, our goal differential is quite higher let's not slip up i i'd like to keep it at three do it with your probiotic powers three two one shim oh god damn four nilling for the shilling putting us up to 44 goal differential yeah let's get in one more training session before we go ahead and head out in the press conference leading up to manchester city i'll go ahead i'll praise my boy pep rub his ball head a little bit wax it up make it nice and shiny for man city we got the big boys in here Irvin lozano uh dolberg promise up three erickson clausen cyprian and Toliso in the diamond dalber a little bit low on stand but we're gonna keep him in sanchez Huste, and then anana in between the sticks simon osadebe ridwald dabo pavon cherney uh not cherney sari and sink robin we have a little bit of a stamina issue but hopefully we can get past amsterdam Maria. yes it is the home leg it is the semi-finals juventus and manchester United sit on the opposite side. Let's see who's in Manchester City's lineup. Ruby Company, Otamende, Kimmich, Joshua Kimmich in the roster. This seems to be the big one. Ian Nacho starting up front with Sergio Aguero behind him. Gundogan, De Bruyne, and Sterling playing. Oh, it's a battle of the 3-4-3. Their players are reacting very, very slow in this match, which usually means the CPU wishes to dick me. Oh, take it down. That should be a pin, maybe a red card. All right, I'll take a yellow, I'll take a yellow. Clausen, do I do it with Clausen? Yeah, he's been pretty good with these. 
Lovely. Tuck it away. Let's do the big man. And we gather in. Team bonding exercise, everyone. Ready? Two. Do, 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 do. I was a little bit let up. Do, 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 do. It's okay. Do, do, do. Lovely. El Capitano says a calm, cool, collected. Really rooted to the spot. Oh, Dolberg, finish it. Damn it. Come on. Dolberg. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Lovely run from El Capitano. He's gone ahead and put on two. Beautiful cross, too. What a fucking peach. Look at this. Spot the run, picks his head up, and then right in between. And it's 2 now. And we are running away with this. <laughs> Lozano has been a fucking Mexican terror on that wing. Company left stranded, can't even get a whiff of him. And Dolberg times his run to perfection, and it's fucking 3 now in the semifinals. Lots of questions to be asked at halftime for Manchester City. He may have come to Amsterdam for the three points, but he stayed for the ass whooping. Oh no, oh no, okay, okay, that's what Manchester City. <laughs> That was a pretty good response. Still a game, still a game. I was writing our, t I was already planning, I was booking hotels, going on Yelp, seeing what was good to eat. The only solace is if they can bag another away goal though, it could spell trouble for us. Oh, that's poor. We're just letting the runner walk in here. Oh no, come on! You gotta make a better tackle there. Oh yes, Onana! Oh, what is thy day? Lovely. Do it, baby. That's the white people's job. We know you white people, baby. Oh my god. Baby, that's not your job no more, baby. Okay. With us, baby. Yeah. Almost a moment of comedy. Oh, and we're free, baby. Take your time, lads. Fuck! Erickson's away. We go ahead, hold it off into the middle. Slid it into Lozano, and the Mexican, he truly has been a brilliant, brilliant man this whole entire afternoon. And he's going to end it off with his little reward. Come on. Come on, get some tacos. Y burritos. Oh, mi hermano es muy bueno. And that is game. Maybe they could have locked up shop at 3-1. They had a chance going back to the Etihad. Now, seems all, but a foregone conclu conclusion. As you can see right here, uh, they fought back. They actually had more domination, good amount of shots, only three of them on target though. And easily man of the match for me is Irvin Lozano because of his play. Doesn't get it, Dolberg does. Unfortunately, we are gonna lose Wildland Cyprian for three weeks. Hopefully, maybe he's back in time for the Champions League final. But the Final T, the piece de resistance, is up against PSV, and we talking all that shit. He means so little to us that I'm actually gonna start my second team up against you, PSV. We got Mbappe, Latin, Moses, Simon, Pavon, and then in. I'm I'm starting to think that maybe Rossi is best suited at the camp position, so we're gonna try him out there. Sari, Nori, and as you can see, Dabo. Actually, we should probably. Not have Nori in the CDM. I do not know why he is there. Let's go ahead and put in someone else. We'll put in Sink Robin now on the left side. Then we have Van Dyke, Bam Bam, and Ritterwald Onana in between six. On the bench, we have Poulsen, Tete, um, Huste, we have Ritterwald, Cherny, De Jong, and Osadebe. All right, here we go. Up against our bitter rivals in the Eredivisie. Ping it! Oh! Oh, Scythe down right on the edge. Oh, he's pulling him over. What is it gonna be? What is it gonna be? I'm thinking yellow. Yeah, don't know if we have a free kick taker in here though. Oh, Sari actually has a bit to him. Why not? Oh! <laughs> oh, any of the goals deserve the big man in this one. Is this one. Yeah. Well, fucking done. Who needs Ericsson? How we even hit one with Ericsson? I don't even know. Finally, we find the breakthrough. It's been pensive. Oh, terrible, terrible defending. 
and just really lacks stuff. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Tale as old as time. <laughs> we let in two in the course of like three minutes. What the flying fuck has happened? Do it, Ritterwald! Oh, fuck off. Triple tap it in. There you go! <laughs> what a fantastic little edit there. And we're tied 2 2. Grab us up, boobies. Get it, pulls it! Yeah. Oh no! I thought it was in! Ugh, frustrating, frustrating game to end it all off. 2 2. We battle back. Oh, we won! Apparently, with the draw, the, my reactions, I think that means we won the league. <laughs> so I was frustrated and all that good stuff, but we're getting all hype out of here. Never mind, never mind, guys. Congrats, like, congrats, like. This is a nice little thing to go ahead and end it off on. But yeah, we got about one, maybe two more episodes left of the ice cream. And if you did enjoy, remember to take a hard wreck nipple, smush it into that like button. Apparently, we're going to go ahead and raise it up. Who's the captain for this? Before we go ahead and sign off, it's Brian! Brian Dabo stealing all of the glory in this episode. Well, well done, Brian. Here, if you want to go ahead and check out the latest ice cream, go ahead and click over here. Ding, if you want to check out my latest FIFA 17 experiment, go ahead and click over here. Ding. My name is Be Must. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Remember to stay yourself. Stay humble. Be weird!